この思いを消してしまうにはまだ人生長いでしょう。Hi everyone, I'm going to react to Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood episode 7 and last episode. Um, Edward and Alphonse were going back home to get themselves fixed, and then they met this doctor, Dr. Marco. Yeah, Marco. And the guy has done research on the uh, the stone, Philosopher's Stone, and he told them where his research was. But then when they left, and the doctor Marco came home, Lost was waiting for her. Him. So,、uh, what's gonna happen? I don't know, but we'll see. Before we get into this episode, if you guys have my reactions, please give it a thumbs up, please subscribe, and please consider supporting me on Patreon where you can find the full link for this reaction, early access to all the animes that I'm reacting to right now. And、uh, yeah, let's get into this episode. And here we go. Okay, they destroyed it. Okay. I thought there was gonna be some kind of. Is he talking about Scar? What the heck is up with him eating people? Like, that's so nasty.、Uh, is he not human? You, you're in trouble. Somehow, I don't want him to die, even though he's after. <laughs> oh my gosh, they killed him, right? ロスボッシュ。ロスボッシュ。ロスボッシュ。ロスボッシュ。ロスボッシュ。ロスボッシュ。ロスボッシュ。ロスボッシュ。ロスボッシュ。ロスボッシュ。ロスボッシュ。
のタイトルのと一字一句間違いないんだなはい間違いありませんあんたすげえよ中央図書館に戻ろう、うん、I won't do that れ俺の登録コードと身分証明の人力俺の年間研究費からそんだけ引き出してシスカに渡してあげてシスカ What do I feel like? Something's gonna happen to. Oh, I'm kind of afraid that something's gonna happen to them. That's what I thought. ハトルよりの項目があるぞハトルそれってもしかしてああ緑の獅子哲学者の月のことかもしれないここもそうだろそうだねこことかもねああよしやってやるぜここのクソ満開な暗号はいや、He's dead. エドワードさんのおかげで母を立派な病院に移すことができましたありがとうございました。サッカーのキメラ事件もまだ片付いてないし。そうね、でさえ忙しいところに寄ってきて、第一文化も丸焼けになっちまって。第一文化。疲れて大変だよ。あ、どうした。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。<laughs> this gonna, they're gonna waste all that time, and then they're gonna be like, okay, let's just go see Dr. Marco, and then Dr. Marco is gonna be dead or something. Not, not um, or something. He's probably dead. What the hell did they discover? They're gonna spill. You don't have to go that route. You can still try to find another way, right? Do you hear me? Ah, couldn't you have come another time? Yeah, truthful. Yeah, truthful. I'm okay. They're using the prisoners? 
顔をしないでくれよ。俺だって考えたでもいいんだ。社長お前たち、この建物に染み込んで、中を調べようか。Of course. なんつってね。<笑><笑> Can he make a door or no? Yeah, that's exactly what I was thinking. How did Al not make any noise when he fell down? So, of course, it's over. Why am I not seeing any intro or outro in this anime? Like, there's only the one episode where I actually heard the intro. Why? When they went to the national, whatever library, to try to find the research and then the thing collapsed, I'm like, okay. Because I was worried that、um, Lost and Gluttony and maybe even Envy, I think that's her name, that they were gonna set up some kind of trap for him or something. But the fact that they just you know, destroyed the building, I'm like, okay, that, that, that's not too bad. And then they decided to go after Scar. And、I'm, I was hoping so much that he would escape, that、like、they wouldn't win. I thought when it was just Gluttony that was. Because、um, when the, start, the fight started between、um, Scar, it was not only Gluttony, right? But then、um, Lust just like, showed up right behind him. I'm like, oh my gosh, him against two. Like, that's it, he's gonna die. And then when they found his clothing, only his clothing, I'm like, I was hoping that he was alive somewhere. And yeah. They didn't get to eat him. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. I just don't want whatever plan Lust and the others have. I want it to fail. So if they were like able to eat Scar, I would be like, nah. Nah. Okay. So Elric, the Elric brothers, <laughs> they thought that was it.、Um, they couldn't find the research right. So, they were told about this woman, Sheska, that used to work in the library. So, is it a library? Yeah, it's a library, right?、Uh-huh. A lot of books. So, they went and looked for her. <laughs> She was buried under a rock. <laughs> a pile of books. They got her out, and she's like, she has like perfect memory, whatever she reads, she remembers. And then they asked her if she, wrote, she read Dr. Marco's. Papers and she said,、like, Yeah, and then she wrote it all down after five days. I think they said, and then when they started reading it, it's like a thousand ways to cook or something, some kind of cookbook. And I'm like, The other two that were accompanying、um, Edward and Elric, Edward and Al, they didn't think much of it, but I'm like, This, if that's the research, it's clearly so encrypted in whatever. It is the, like a cookbook, you know. I don't know that the actual ingredients, the actual ingredients, um, that the actual research was encrypted in that, right? So the Elric brothers they knew that that's what it was, so they took it away and then they were researching it. And then when they were having some trouble trying to decipher it, I'm like, are they gonna try to go to Marco? Because at first Edward was saying no, right? So I'm like, maybe he's gonna. They're gonna continue to try to decir- decipher it by themselves, but then they're not gonna be able to do it. And then they're gonna w a n t to see Dr. Marco, and then they're gonna know that Dr. Marco has been killed or something. So I thought that's what was gonna happen, but no, they actually deciphered it themselves. And then it turned out that in order to create those stones, you need to sacrifice human lives, which, as much as they want. To return themselves to how they used to work, how they used to be, 
they're not gonna sacrifice people for that so that was just like they were crushed and I wanted to know what Ed was gonna ask Al while they were lying down there he said that he's been afraid to ask him but he wanted to know and then the major had to bust him I really wanted to know I feel like since he's the one that sort of like came up with the idea of bringing their mother back to life and then it was basically i'm not gonna say his fault because al also participated in it right she also he also did the research he also like they were both of them were in it together but since the idea came from ed maybe he feels like alphonse might be harboring some resentment toward him and that's why he wanted to ask him or something but no the major had to like mess everything up and that's the major was well, sort of like consoling them and then he mentioned the word truth and then um edward when he mentioned truth I'm, i was thinking of the truth world that Ed was in while they were doing their first, uh, while they were trying to resuscitate, the, resuscitate, uh, revive the mother, bring the mother back to life, whatever. And then he got stuff in this truth world where the truth was waiting for him or something or other. That's what I was thinking. I f- totally forgot about the conversation, what the, uh, Dr. Marco said. So he's like, okay, there must be more to this, um, truth stuff, research stuff. So they're like, okay, there are other research lab, lab, Laboratories, and then there's one that's like unused. They said it's not used. You're not supposed to go there. But then the fact that the thing is like next to a prison, and that you need human lives to create those philosopher stones, and you know, it makes sense that they're gonna be using that research lab and those prisoners to create the stones and everything. So they went there. And they had to separate. Edward went, by, went in by himself. <laughs> and the way he called himself small. Oh my gosh, I love that. So yeah, they're about to be attacked. Probably like, because there were two people in there. One is number 48, the other is something else. The 66, I think. So I think one of them is going to be attacking Ed, and the other one's going to be attacking Al. Because we saw the one jump down to Alphonse. So yeah. Also, I found it kind of interesting that Roy wants to become the Fuhrer. I don't know why, but I feel like, like I said, I don't trust the current Fuhrer, Bradley. Yeah, King Bradley. I don't trust him. I feel like he's aligned with um, the lost and the others and the father and whatever goal that they're after. So, if that's the truth maybe roy also doesn't trust king bradley and that's why he wants to become the fuhrer so that he can have complete control over the military that's what he said right maybe he doesn't the fact that um king bradley is the one that ordered the alchemist to kill all those each balance and everything Maybe it's from that point on that Roy doesn't trust him and that's why he wants to become the Fuhrer so he can actually like discover what it, whatever it is that King Bradley might be hiding. I don't know. That's what I think. Thank you guys for watching my reaction and if you liked it, please give it a thumbs up, please subscribe and please consider supporting me on Patreon where you can find the following for this reaction, early access and vote on polls of which anime I'm going to be reacting to next. And yeah, I will see you on Thursday. Bye. Nothing